Hey guys, welcome back. Welcome to Majestic Notion. How are you guys today? Hopefully well. I just wanted to come up here and get a collective reading out for you guys. So thank you so much for joining. Thank you for being here. Please hit that like button for me. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't. And hit that notification bell for those of you who want to know when when my readings come out. All right. Thank you guys so much for your comments and all your support. And thank you to those who have uh, <laughs> said a little something to people that don't want to hear me sing. Um, I have to say that when I sing, it goes along with the reading, whether I know how to sing or not. Okay, a lot of readers, if you look around at other readers, they sing because a song pops up that has to do with the reading. It connects to how somebody feels or how so what somebody is going through. So if you don't like people that sing just keep it moving your comment need not apply okay it, it you're wasting your breath your 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 finger muscles to write something that I care nothing about okay I'm gonna sing regardless of how you feel about it so thank you to those who you know confront these fools that are miserable themselves and they can't stand somebody just to sing a few notes that actually can help them out you know as far as understanding what's happening in their situation clearly the, these types of people are not going within and healing and bettering their life so misery loves company so they have to troll um, YouTube and leave negative comments you know I hope that works out for you alright other than that let's keep it moving we're not gonna give them too much time not on this channel and those people are gonna get blocked and deleted anyways so Let's continue, Spirit, for my collective, what is going on. So thank you guys for your support. I really do appreciate it. Let's do this. And let's sing if I will. Alright? If I have to and if I need to, I will. Alright, what's going on here? keep seeing this wealthy man and this false person. All right, let's see what's going on. Poverty. I heard poverty stricken. Poverty mindset. Scarcity mindset. Okay, low vibrational energy. Someone that is a constant state of broke mentality. Um, so this could be the kind of person that always uh, leans on others and is very codependent here. And, you know, we're going to see if they're empathic or narcissistic, because that can go either way. What else, Spirit? Occupation. Someone might need to get a job here. They might have got caught off. Yeah, I got the same energy when I was kind of like just checking out the energy, community. Okay. Somebody could be trying to get some sort of job here in their community. Why do I feel like something's going to be like obvious to everybody? You know, I'm feeling like somebody might be pissed off because they're, whatever they thought they were going to get here, they're not. I don't know what's going on. This might be a negative Nancy here. Hmm. I'm getting somebody's about to be embarrassed. I don't know. Let's see what's going on here. Maybe somebody did some bad things, getting some bad karma for it. 37 and 34 could be significant here. But there is a 10. Adding up to 10 here. And then adding up to seven here. Ah. Yeah, the divine, something about a main female here. The divine is in this. Spirit is in this. What's going on here? Somebody is about to get their ass handed to them, is what I'm seeing. Tell me about it, spirit. Sudden wealth. Sudden wealth. I feel like somebody was expecting sudden wealth, and now they have to get a job. 
It's this main female. Whoever this main female is, she was expecting sudden wealth. Okay, we have pathway. 35 could be significant here. That adds up to 8. And we have the number 11. Bad health. Huh. I'm not liking this energy. Ooh. Yeah. Whoever this person is in the distant horizon. Wealthy man. Okay, so this is somebody's main female. This is a thief somebody's dealing with. Okay? They're poverty stricken. Meaning this person doesn't like to work for what they get. They're expecting some type of sudden wealth here from this wealthy man. But they're expecting this person to die over time. Basically. If that's the case, they're doing something and watching this person slowly get sick and to his death. Somebody here is mean. Somebody's doing something here to this wealthy man that works hard, overworked, okay? And this person is expecting this money. This could be like um, some sort of, um, somebody here could have some sort of um, uh, like insurance, you know what I mean? Like when your spouse passes, somebody here is up to no good. Yeah, privileged lady, she's expecting this income with unexpected income. This is a privileged person that doesn't work. But she's going to have to get a job is what I'm seeing here. Because what she's planning is not going to work in her favor. There's a message about a child here. Yeah, false person. Can't make this up with main... Oh, hold on a second. With main female. Man, this person's up to no good. I don't know who married this person. But I'm hearing shysty. This person is shysty. So they could have gotten pregnant here to keep this person stuck is what I'm feeling. Because this is a false person. We have false person with main female. That card kept coming up. This is somebody's main female. This rich man. Or wealthy man. And there's an addition to the family is what I feel with this child. Okay. Now, it doesn't necessarily have to be their child. Because they're dealing with a false person thief, poverty mindset stricken, scarcity stricken, privileged B-I-T-C-H here. This person works hard for this person to be sitting pretty. And they're expecting sudden wealth, meaning they want their wealth and they're, they want to steal it somehow, some way. But they're, they're, they could be making this person sick with bad health and coughing. What? Oh, this is so wrong. Yeah, look at this. They're, they're not going to get their way. I feel like this was out in the public. This it, uh, Maybe... You guys, this person wants to be with you guys. And somebody's going to be in despair. And it says here, not hiring. So whatever this person thought they were going to, you know, ex expecting, going to get. They better expect jail time. This person's going to jail. So they must be under investigation, okay? Okay. Something's going on here. Yeah, they're going to get a gift from jail. <laughs> Here's your gift. Your jail sale. Courthouse. And the, yeah, there's a marriage here. Judication. This is a marriage. Somebody got married. 
got locked up, felt locked up with somebody here. Whoever this person is, is a thief. They're a false person. They're privileged, B-I-T-C-H. They're poverty stricken. They get in relationships for money. This person is a scammer, a fraud. They're expecting this person's wealth and they are definitely making this person sick. Of course they're gonna go to jail. I mean if this if this wealthy man is um, smart enough and this has been going on long enough where they're already getting sick here they need to I'm hoping they already have a lawyer here because something's going on yeah we have concern message yeah this person is concerned about this person message of concern concern thought and great fortune so this person is already feeling what's going on here so there's got to be an investigation going on here we have mature man official person in a house here with journey and high honor Okay, let's get into this. There, This is some crazy shit right here. Oh, man. People just... They just be doing some shady ass shit. This is so shady. Like, how do you feel like you can get away with that? Now your, your, your plan is to, what, poison this person's food, water, drink? So slowly poison their ass? If you have any um, antifreeze anywhere, you better watch out because you can't taste antifreeze. It's a, a, apparently that's a big um, thing that people like this would use to put in your desserts and your drinks because it's supposed to be sweet in flavor. That shit will kill you. But I don't understand how these people think they're not, they're they're going to get away with this. They're going to prison. They're trying to kill somebody for money. Slowly. This is a sick person. And there are sick people out there that do this. So clearly there's a marriage here that somebody obviously did not get any kind of prenup. There could be some form of life insurance here that somebody's trying to get because obviously with bad health and the death card with the thief that's not giving me good vibes that that makes me feel like somebody's trying to slowly kill off someone so that they can get this money somehow some way I hope the cops are watching shit or whoever this resonates for man oh boy let's see what we got going on here it would just be shady yeah we got an emperor and an empress that's a marriage right there. That ain't no damn empress. And we got destiny playing a role here. Yeah, somebody needs to walk away here. Absolutely. It's destined for them to walk away from this. Shit, no shit. I've watched crime stories before. These people, they'd be putting some crazy shit in your food and drink. Mm -mm. Two of swords. Yeah, this person has a, a blocked. They have a block. They have issues. They got the veil. They have a limited mindset. They got a one-track mind. Okay. Now I'm hearing that song, Sally's got a one-track mind. It doesn't matter if it's yours or mine. Yeah. We have the sun here. Okay. Under occupation. We have the king of wands. With sun wealth. 
Okay, this is somebody ambitious, probably somebody that likes what they do for a living, but they overwork. So somebody in some form of leadership position at their career and their job. Some of them could be entrepreneurs. We did see the emperor. Definitely a provider, somebody that's already established, wealthy, able to, you know, for this person to be privileged. Obviously, that person does not work. Their wife. Okay. So they're a huge provider here. And Page of Swords. This person could be, you know, watching or doing some sort of research here. Making some sort of future plans with Pathway here. I'm also feeling like this person needed to see, they're seeing things clearly where they couldn't before. Because they are starting to question what's happening in their life and their surroundings when it comes to this person. Possibly their health as well. They could be feeling quite tired. Something's going on. This could be a Leo specifically for somebody here. Or you have that Leo rising, Leo sun, Leo somewhere. Okay. This could also be an Aries or Sagittarius. Doesn't have to be though. Uh, let's see what else. Ace of Swords. Uh-huh. Okay, we got the truth when it comes to this person. Somebody here has clarity when it comes to this person also. There's some truth coming out and a decision being made. I feel the decision was made. It's just a matter of this court battle that's happening right now. Somebody needs to check their health. Yeah, I'm hearing CAT scan. You need a sonogram or whatever. You need, you need to check your health. You need to do a full physical. Lovers. I feel like with the sun and the lovers, this is someone, we did see the courting card. This person wants to court you, okay? They are uh, focusing on work right now, thinking about you. You bring this person happiness, clarity, joy, laughter, okay? After some, a miserable last marriage, let me tell you. You're, you are the sun in this person's life, okay? They have hope, faith, something to look forward to. But they need to get away from this person. They know you're the truth. They have clarity. They're cutting this person off. Absolutely. But they need to check their health. Yeah, this person has a crush on you. They like you. Page of Cups. Knight of Swords. Yeah, this person is tracking this person is what I'm feeling. They're always watching, lurking, scheming. I don't like this. The person that they're with. They could hire other people as well. You can expect anything from that person. They don't work they don't work alone. There's other people working with this wife that they are with. Or going through a, a divorce. Yeah, there's the jail time, darling. Yep, clarity's coming. Truth, the truth gonna get you locked up. The truth ain't gonna set you free here. It's gonna set him free, and somebody's going to jail. Incarcerated. Mm -hmm. Somebody's going to jail. Oh yeah, they know the truth. So there's something going on in court here that's gonna determine this, obviously. Ace of Pentacles, yeah. You are the gift here with the lovers and the sun. This person definitely wants to make an offer. They're ready to they're ready to move forward here. Okay, they're finding out some things about this person. Things are coming to light, absolutely. But this person is lurking. Hardcore. Yeah, the tower. Mayor London Bridge is falling down, falling down, falling down. London Bridge is falling down, my fair lady. Is that even the right song there? I don't know, but we got the tower. Somebody's having a breakthrough. 
definitely things are falling apart domino effect here domino effect to the truth and what is going on somebody man man somebody went in blind into this situation it made a wrong choice you know it happens sometimes people come across real convincing but sooner or later their true colors come out yeah lesson learned yeah this person is being guided away again by spirit and this person is tracking watching their every move this person meant to go through a transformation and help others as well along the way um, they have a higher calling a life purpose anytime you have a life you know a, a higher calling a life purpose there are going to be people that the devil manipulates and uses to create blockages in your life that's just how that energy works okay they don't want you to prosper and be happy there are forces beyond our control and beyond what we know and see that work against us and use people mentally especially low vibrational people with a negative mindset a, sh a shadow aspect to them they're susceptible to these types of energies and being controlled manipulated and maneuvered you know I'm not saying they ain't guilty of what they're doing. They sure are. They know the difference between right and wrong. But they don't like to come out of their shadow. They, they're a thief. A um, con artist. A shapeshifter. Multiple personality type of person. They adapt to the environment to fit their, their own standards, their own agenda. Okay? Very convincing type of person anybody would fall yeah the devil I can't make this up anybody would fall prey to somebody like this when you don't you know when you're when you're you don't have high level of discernment yet when you haven't worked on yourself healed yourself you know this is why this lesson is here as well so this person never falls into this trap again this is the devil devil in the details darling trying to keep someone bound trapped unable to see think straight that's what they do but clarity is here ace of swords the devil has been seen found out cut out okay queen of pentacles okay this is where you come in they see you as a gift they see you as their earth angel they see you as someone they want to marry with the lovers and the sun they're working towards this Somebody knows the shitstorm they got themselves in. Seven of Wands. They're protecting you from this. Okay? Spirit could be blocking this person till they get through with everything here. Okay? With the tower. This person's also trying to protect whatever assets they have, however they can. three of cups they're coming to have this union with you somewhere along this pathway but they got to get rid of this person that's following them tracking them watching them observing them or paying other people to do so three of cups they want to be happy they want to come towards you they want to make you an offer they see you as the one but damn this person got tripped up big time they can't wait to get past this this energy damn let's look at the bottom here the moon with the page of wands and the death card yeah this person oh yep man this is a past life uh, issue past life karmic issue okay somebody could be dealing with a Libra here um, we also have Scorpio we have Pisces cancer Scorpio somebody was dealing with somebody very immature dark full of illusions very creative when it comes to their shadow okay this is the kind of person that definitely over time has been trying to kill this person by putting stuff in their drinks okay there could be children involved absolutely but this is a past life issue 
balance needs to be restored here. Yeah, they're dealing with a taker, four of pentacles. This person puts in, this person just takes. They don't give. No, no reciprocity at all. They just get their, you know, this person could be abusive as well. This person is tired of playing the victim. Okay. Um, they don't want to be a victim of this anymore. And they're working Eight of Pentacles to get away from this because they want to follow their heart and their intuition here. Yeah. Taking a leap of faith. Absolutely. Trying to go within and lick their wounds here. They definitely were betrayed. Ten of Swords. Okay. They're gaining insight as to everything that has been transpiring here. Trying to gain more balance in their life and, and, you know, have patience with themselves while they heal, lick their wounds, you know, ask questions, you know, get in tune with themselves, hide out as well from this person. While this person's still scheming, seven of swords, deceiving, behind the scenes, the moon and judgment. I tell you, they're getting karma and that's jail time. They can't escape karma. They're trying to. They can't. Spirit on their ass. Yeah. They're trying to go towards somebody else here. They could have someone else that they're trying to convince that, um, oh, we're meant to be together. I feel like that's how this person starts with her charm and charisma to create illusions here. And they work from their shadow. This is like a dark high priestess. Okay. And they like to, you know, create illusions. Like, oh, we're meant to be very narcissistic energy. I've never felt this way before. You're my soulmate. Yeah. Yeah. Meanwhile, they're fucking juggling. Nah. This ain't the one, darling. What the hell? Wow. This is nuts. Um... I'm going to get the scoop deck for this side. Let's see what's going on here. Yeah, this devil, if, when I read it this way across with the Queen of Pentacles and the devil, it's a gold digging. I, I'm hearing that song. Gold digging girls is driving me crazy. I can take it no more. Yep. This person creates blockages and third parties. Oh, man. Look at that. Copycat. Somebody tried to be an empress. Somebody tried to copycat. Until I told you this person adapts to their environment um, to get what they want. They become whoever and whatever they need to be in order to create that illusion and lure someone in. <laughs> Man, they try to become this person's match. It was all a fucking scheme. That's some crazy shit. As I saw blockages and shook. Yeah, this person's like, I feel like they're so shocked by the shit they're finding out. Yeah, there it is again. Someone's mimicking everything you do. Uh, for some of you, they know who you are, uh, collective, and they're trying to mimic you. This person, very scheme. It, this is the kind of person that tried to probably pretend that they were a divine feminine. Performer, entertainment industry. Somebody here got taken. Taken. This is the kind of person that comes into your life and does just that. Devours and destroys till you're little pieces on the ground so you're a bunch of little pieces on the ground and then they move on to the next this is a destroyer because they're this is their energy poverty stricken they don't have good karma so they have to destroy others to get anything in life clout chaser absolutely fucking unbelievable And they, they pegged somebody here. 
I mean, they even got them to marry them. Yeah, caution. Proceed with caution. Mm-hmm. Yep. She's coming to light. Secrets are about to be revealed. What this person couldn't see before. Yep. Lying. Someone is lying. Yep, they're lying in court, too. This person's lying in court. Damn. Desires and caught up. Look at that. Don't get caught slipping. This person got caught up cheating. Third party situation. Damn, this person is a thief, a liar, a cheater, a whore. Situation is more balanced. Y you think? I told you this person would do anything. Black magic. This person is doing shit in this person's food. Man, what the hell? And they try to apologize to come back. Wrong way, Spirit said. Don't you take that apology, man. Don't fall for it. This ain't Bambi. Okay, this is fucking Lucifer in a dress. That's them on the inside. Take a good fucking look. Do not, by any means, take this person's apology. You need to grow a pair. You need to you need to have boundaries with this person. You need to just get a divorce and get the fuck out. I feel like that's what they did over and over. It was the wrong fucking way. This person gave this person too many choices, too many too many uh, chances. Excuse me. Even after they got caught up at some point during their relationship. All right, astro travel. You may be experiencing out of body experiences. This is what they feel with you guys, and they needed to self reflect. Okay, and take that moment to do so. And, and be grateful that they, they get, they're getting their ass out of this. Okay? Because this was a blockage, big time, for this person. And they're getting an upgrade. Your life is about to have an upgrade. They need to get the hell on. Spirit has been giving this person signs, numbers, signs, synchronicities, feathers, pennies, whatever the hell, music. Through their waking life, through movies, shows, whatever. Spirit has been trying to tell this person, hey, you're going the wrong way. You need to change directions. This person ain't no good. This could have been happening since Thanksgiving. Where Spirit was like screaming in this person's ear. And that's when shit started to be revealed is what I'm seeing. Yep, spell work. Casting spells. Yeah. With the magician here. How to manifest shit. They will grow from this. And somebody here had some addictions. Okay. Complete shadow queen. Damn. Oh, what's going on over here, spirit? Damn. This is crazy. Use my manifest deck here. For the collective, what what's what's going on here? Every day I'm shuffling, shuffling. Yeah, this person is faithful, empathic, loving, and giving. This could also be your energy. This person got played. If you only knew what's coming. Okay, so yeah, this person is faithful, empathic, loving, and giving. And they just fell victim to the wrong person. Okay, they're coming. Surprise, exciting news, anticipation, and manifestation. So you're manifesting this person in. They already see you. They see you as everything. Okay? They know the truth. It took them a while to realize this. I mean, damn, they could have been together for like 
a long time, years. I mean, they were married to this person. Yeah, this person wants to come back to claim this person. They want to mark their territory, control, possession, and obsessed. That's that Knight of Swords, Page of Swords. They don't want this person to come towards you. and But they are. Spirit is guiding this person far, far away from this person. Um, they might have to move here. They might be planning on moving. Yep, Divine Masculine. Self-care looking good, preparing for union, stability, healing, learning, growing, planning, and delegating. Absolutely. All of it. Bottom of the deck. You light up a room when you walk in. That's why the sun is here. You light up their life. You light up my life. You make me feel whole to carry on. You, you light up my days. Something like that. Your presence demands attention. You are simply alluring. I know we are soulmates. I know you're my twin flame. Okay, I feel like they met a karmic soulmate, and they know that, but they know you are their twin flame. Just because they're a soulmate here does not mean they're meant to be. This was a past life issue, past life karma. They had to close out this lifetime. This is the kind of person with all this fail work. She, she always pops up in his lifetimes. Okay, they needed to clear this karma this lifetime so that they can be with their true divine counterpart. Okay, so they know the difference is what I'm seeing here between karmic soulmates and twin flames. Now, there are high-level soulmates, good soulmates, but clearly this was not one of them. So this person tried to pretend like they were the divine feminine because of the soul connection they had. Because it can be just as intense with the devil and the lovers here. Okay? That's how the devil fools people away from their purpose and their divine counterparts by mimicking trying to duplicate okay often imitated never duplicated darling carmen copy and eh, not gonna work eventually we see through the veil and that's what's happening here where we couldn't see it before Because we were under illusions by someone that was quite creative, working from their shadow, plotting your damn death. Unbelievable. So they know you are their twin flame. They feel you in the core of their soul. I feel your presence when I fall asleep at night. That's the astral travel and telep tele telepathic communication. And there you go. When I think of you, I think of forever with you. I want to marry you. We have it here. Ace of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles, the lovers in the sun. Out of my dreams and into my life. My heart and soul screams, you are the one. Forever on my mind, wedding union, going the extra mile proposal. That's what they see with you. They're getting ready to step into the right lover's path. I would love to speak with you. Reaching out, message, text, email. Might actually call. Clearly this person, you may not have their number, they may not have yours. So you expect like an email or DM from this person. They're going to find a way. Yeah, this is this is what they were with. It was lust. I know I was a snake. Insane chemistry, inner childhood wounds, triggers, defense mechanisms, the mirror effect, karmic soulmate lessons. There you go. And they're feeling magnetically pulled and drawn to you at this time. Wanting to be by your side, yearning for you. I want to see you. Can we talk? Man, guys, this person just got so... So sidetracked. But that's what the devil does. And I'm sure they couldn't see this for a while. They were overthinking. They were under serious illusions here. But the Ace of Swords is finally here. Finally the code has been cracked. They see. The egg has come out of its shell. 
okay. Um, let me get some more card here, more messages. Unbelievable. Once a player, always a player. You can't trust these kind of people. I mean, damn. He could have forgave them around Thanksgiving because they caught this person cheating on, on them. They got caught. Then she apologized and, you know, did her thing. However manipulative they do their thing here. And uh, he gave her another chance. But they're going through a divorce. You trust and believe that. They're going to jail for something. Yeah. You guys are a jackpot vibrational match. With the sun and the lovers and the ace of pentacles. Absolutely. My friends think you're hot. They tell me I should go for it. So they, clearly they've been showing uh, their friends your pictures. I never believed in soulmates till I met you. You threw me for a loop. I'm feeling like that's um, the twin flame. Like that type of connection where things can actually work out. Okay, once you do the inner work, of course, and they're letting go. I will no longer hold on to things not meant for me. You guys are drinking from the same love potion. Can you feel the love tonight? Yeah, this is this person. So, this is what they do. They're trying to get back into their good graces again. I never believed in soulmates till I met you. Please give me another chance. We already saw the apology card. Do not give this person another chance if you're the masculine watching and you're in this kind of situation. Dark energy. They're, you, I'm telling you, don't let this person give you anything to drink. Do not eat at home. Do not let this person cook for you. I don't care what you, what you think. Not everybody has your empathic, compassionate heart. You need to understand that this person is low vibrational, works from their shadow, they're a thief, they're a false person, they're fake personality. They were chasing you from the beginning for clout. You got to take off the, the rose-colored glasses here. I know you see it. Don't set, don't let this person manip mentally and emotionally manipulating you, manipulate you because I know they use tactics like tears, pity, okay? Welcome to the pity party. Uh-uh trying to be the damsel in distress here no don't allow this person to manipulate you anymore okay you have someone that will be a very important part of your life that's the counterpart that you already know is your twin flame divine masculine divine feminine and great minds think alike shared interests but you guys have shared interest as well yeah you were wishy-washy for a while because you couldn't see this person for who they were. Clearly, there's a huge difference. Night and day. Two of Swords, but you have the clarity, Ace of Swords. The devil had you locked up in your head. And you finally got the code. So don't, don't allow this person to manipulate you. Romantic vibes around you at this time. I smell potential. Yes, Divine Feminine, Divine Masculine. Yeah, this could be happening in retrograde. So this person is trying to come back, trying to apologize. Don't do it. This false person that they were married to. You better just keep it pushing with that court shit because this person's lying out the yin yang. Yeah, exactly. They might have been your soulmate, but darling, that that's just a fucking label. You need to see the situation for what it really is. Mr. and Mrs. Casanova, keep your eyes peeled with this one. I don't give a damn who they are. They're not a good person, period. Yeah. You're into your, your twin flame. Okay, and divine timing is here. We have... 
And we have summertime, unforgettable. They will never forget you. Of course they won't. You were giving them the world. How could they? And you're into your twin flame. Divine timing. This is your twin flame. You're so into this person. The hunger is real. Springtime love is in the air. You've been thinking about your divine feminine hardcore. But you've had this person messing you up in your head. Toying with your emotions. Mentally manipulating you. Smoke and mirrors. Absolutely. They don't want you. They want your money. They want your money. Period. This person you were married to. So, you better definitely check yourself before you wreck yourself here. I already see the tower. So shit's coming down anyway. You already know. You have clarity. So do not let this person manipulate you. Because they're real good at it. Really good at it. Damn. Let's get some, some of these here. I can't make it up. Mental manipulation, just in case. Spirit, there it is. Spirit letting you know, you were being mentally manipulated. This is not somebody you can trust. Family may be standing in the way of this connection, too. Of course. I don't know if it's the connection between you and your feminine or you and this psycho. I would imagine it's the psycho. Because we do have mental manipulation here. So they see this person for who they really are. I just feel like it took this masculine some time. Okay. Genuine and one of a kind. That's the Divine Feminine, or that's how they were seeing them in the past. It's like, what do you mean? They're genuine. They're one of a kind. Eh. What else? Yeah, now you're feeling resentful. Don't, don't hang on to that resentment, okay? Let it go. Okay, what angers you, controls you, don't allow it. They do have anxiety. They want to talk to their Divine Feminine. They just don't know what to say right now because of all this shit going on. And clearly, this person's still like on, in their tail watching their move. They could be tracking their car as well or following them, driving by their house. If you're moving, do not tell anybody where you live especially anyone that she has ever spoken to it or is connected to because trust me they're going to try to find out where you at and they were sleeping with your friend that's who you caught them with damn damn that's why the resentment is here Wow. Fraud. I told you they were a fraud. Damn. Undeniably attracted. This person could have fell for someone that was beautiful on the outside. Um, like I said, devil on the inside. Or they find you undeniably attractive, divine feminine. Yeah. They felt helpless. And they could have got ghosted. Okay? Because this person's trying to avoid this judgment. Yeah, they got plenty of those admirers. What else, spirit? 
Yep, life of the party. This person likes to have a good time sexually with others. It's all about the dollar and what they can get out of other people. This person is a rotten potato. Yep, never going back. Thank goodness. Good. Remember that. Never going back. This person ain't gonna change anytime soon. They weren't changed before they met you. They're not gonna change now. And I know you're feeling some type of way, but hey, huge lesson. Yeah. Yeah. Court case legal system. This person is trying to escape judgment. So I don't know where they're at. They ghosted. They definitely did, but they're still watching. They, they're lying. Okay, they're not going to get away from this imprisonment. I don't know what's going on here. They're like, I'm not sure we can just be friends, but I'd like to start somewhere. To going within. Okay, I feel like that's what they're thinking about you it's like they want to start somewhere when it comes to the divine feminine they just don't know how to approach you right now because they're going through all of this they are going within a clean slate they could have had a major money loss here as well um, but there is yeah there's a new home purchase and great times ahead so definitely there could be a move here so this person's planning on getting away after all this court stuff you're sending them good vibes Okay, so this is for the feminines that understand what's happening here. And definitely there's a karmic that's on their shit list. And yep, their ego is going to cost them. With, can't make it up, arrested. Now, for some of you, they could have went to jail for something. They made something look a certain way and it was the masculine they had in jail okay but I do feel like this karmic is going to jail for something um, maybe they had this person in you know doing things that they shouldn't have either okay so I don't know how that's gonna be different for all of you yeah scared of the un they were scared of the unknown I guess when it came to you because there was a path there was they they were met with the lovers path and they followed the devil into the wrong what into the wrong path yeah be careful who you lay with and yep, I don't want to be in this situation anymore. I'm coming for my Divine Feminine. And yep, this karmic was all... She thought she won the damn lotto here. All of a sudden, oh, I got me a wealthy man. Buttering you up for clout. Can't make it up. And Feminines, you're on a whole new level. And this person still trying to butter him up with lies about how they're meant to be we already saw the soulmate yeah oh but we're meant to be I'm the divine feminine yeah sure fucking fraud anyone trying to convince you anyways that they're the divine feminine they're, they're in your face trying to convince you of how you're meant to be it's not the person for you That's something you feel and you both talk about at some point. You don't need to be convinced. But they took that soulmate energy for their own benefit into making you believe that you were the Divine Feminine. It was the Devil's Path where you learn a huge karmic lesson. That's all that was. 40, uh, 54 14 on the clock all right guys that's what I have for you uh, damn this, this is some crazy shit this person spell work and all that let me just get a few cards from for that to see what kind of spell work this is and then we're done there they did spell work black magic and this is the kind of person to do whatever it takes to keep this money they don't want to let go of that money. They're going to have to get a job. I'm telling you. Nobody's going to want to hire this person after this. Because I feel like something is going to be publicized or people are going to know in the community. 
We saw that community card. She about to get found out. Alright, Spirit, what kind of black magic was this karmic doing here? Or is still doing, because I'm sure they're still doing it. Completion. The energy work done against you is done. It's over. The spell has been broken. Yes! That's why the tower is here. Cup. So this is divine protection. Done, darling. Absolutely. That's why they're getting karma. That's why they're running away. That's why they're lying. That's why they're ghosting. They're getting caught up in your face. Pity, yeah, what I say, pity party. <laughs> Someone is going through tough times and wants to wants you to experience the same thing. So there you go. Karma's catching up to her. And they want this person and you to experience the same. Eh, done. Blocked and deleted. Access denied. Too funny. Now, this person really needs to get cleansing. Spiritually transmitted disease. It's because this person was sleeping around. They have all kinds of dark entities attached to them. Spiritual attachments. They have possibly given this person. Could have transmitted something to this person. I mean, this person was putting this person in third parties. This is not a, a, a good person that closes their legs. This is a highly low vibrational energy. And it says, be careful someone courting or dating you is dealing with a lot of energetic burdens and dark entities. They need a major, major cleansing. That's why they're feeling sick. So they really need to go to the doctor for one, but they also need to purify their energy. Take purification baths. Um, they might need to... Uh, for some of you that know how to work with um, herbs, they might need to come to you for that as well. Um, definitely do not sleep with this masculine until they purify this energy. No offense to the masculine, but you do need to cleanse your energy. Because it, whether you know how energy works or not, you know, this person was filled with dark darkness and dark entities that now are attached to you. Okay? So you need to cleanse your energy. Um, wow. So you were under some serious mental manipulation, not just by this person, but by the devil, by other entities. You definitely had spiritual attachments. They couldn't let you see. You were under a specific heavy fog, spiritual warfare here. They were on you like white on rice. Okay? And you definitely... Now that you have clarity, you had a moment of clarity, don't allow yourself to be fog-headed again. Get out of there, cleanse your energy, you're going to see things a little even more clear. Eat right, food has a lot to do with your mental state. What you process through your, through your body has a lot to do with your mental state. You need to go through a heavy cleansing of eating right, exercising, meditation, absolutely. Don't skip it, okay? If you're... If you're going on a path on a new journey and you want to be with your divine feminine I mean I see it here self-care looking good preparing for union stability healing learning growing planning and delegating okay purification baths whatever it is there's information if you have some sort of STD or anything like that there's information out there okay when it comes to natural herbs if you want to cure it that way I'm not a doctor I do know my herbs here and there, I do, but you need to um, do some research on that. And I mean, obviously that's not for everybody, but because this, this person was quite the whore, I have to say, just like that, because that's exactly what she was, or what she is, okay? Um, this person, dirty, dirty, dirty. Highly low vibrational, highly narcissistic. Um, ugh, just nasty. You know, I get it, you're empathic, loving, and giving, but you cannot make yourself the little lamb here, the sacrificial lamb all the time for people like this. These are not people you can change, heal, or save. 
You need to save yourself. Because you became the victim in this situation. But you can't play the victim when you keep making the same choices. You see what I'm saying? So, wise up. Don't allow this person um, to manipulate you anymore. Take your power back. Get the fuck on. And start over. It, but you need to burn the bridge here. Okay? If you have children with this person, unfortunately, you, that bridge can't be burned. But make the connection between you and your children. Okay? You don't need to be a provider for this person. They need to figure that out. You need to be a provider for your children. Absolutely. You need to make sure that because this person is sick in the head, that your children are well taken care of, of course. You might be fighting for custody because of this mental health issue. Rightfully so. I don't believe children should be under this person's care because of the issues they have. I mean, they try, they're try. they trying to slowly kill you. They have over some time. Not just with black magic, but with shit that they put in your food. That was obvious here. Whether you believe it or not, this person is evil. Okay? So take precautions, for your, not just for yourself, but for your own children. Okay? That's what I got here. Let me know in the comments if anybody resonates with this. Um, damn. I mean, I know you're seeing the truth. You got clarity. Just don't allow this person to manipulate you and try to apologize. You know, what they want from you is their is your money, not your heart. They don't care about you. Of course not. They'll sleep with anybody to get what they want. They don't care about you. They don't even care about themselves. Remember that. Alright? Um, and I'll talk to you guys later. I wish you the best. I, sure, I surely do. Alright? Bye-bye.